and this is just what I do. I'm not a cosmetologist, but I've never had any negative issues doing it this way. Let's go. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Serena, hence the intro, hence the channel name. That's so Rena. You get it corner, I know, but that's just how we are here. So, girl, boom. If you're new to my channel, you probably don't know. My hair is relaxed, my real hair. Okay, y'all see me in wigs all the time, but under my real hair, it's relaxed. I just relaxed. I went back relaxed after years of being natural. I had 4C hair. And you're going to be able to tell when I show y'all this new growth, okay? I had 4C hair, and I just didn't like it. Um, and it just wasn't convenient for me to manage so i went back to the relaxer so today we're going to be doing a relaxer touch-up video if you want to see my whole like relaxer journey i guess i'll make a playlist and link it up here but the original video where i uh relaxed my hair and switched back was three months ago so this is a three month stretch of no relaxer in my hair because i you know wear protective style so my hair has been braided up for a while which is kind of gross but yeah so that is why we look like this today so yeah y'all i'm just gonna do a relaxer touch up kind of talk to you a little bit about my hair and all that i'm not a licensed cosmetologist hairstylist none of that so i really don't care about y'all in the comment section trying to come for me like <laughs> my hair has yet to fall out like my hair doesn't fall out so as long as I'm not bald headed at the end, I really don't care for no hate comments. So, yeah. I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into it. I'm going to show y'all this new growth real quick. Um, yeah, so let me turn around. So, basically, you can kind of see, like, right here in my kitchen area and around the perimeter is where my new growth is. And, uh, you know, the scalp part. So, where your hair grows in, that is where it's pretty much reverts for me so if I was to wash my hair it would be like I was natural again wherever the relaxer is not so I'm only going to relax where the new growth is and not throughout because it's not a virgin relaxer it's just a touch up so yeah I just took my braid down down that was under my sewing so yeah let's just jump right into it <laughs> i always use the same relaxer and it is the ors olive oil one this one is in the strength normal i have used super before i don't really want to so i won't so we're going to keep using the normal and so it comes with this it comes with this basically everything has numbers on it it tells you how to mix it all that and then you have gloves and a little uh chopstick in there and you have like the activator and stuff like that so i'm just gonna go ahead and mix everything together this in a tutorial y'all just you know watching my process you're watching my process honey <laughs> Okay, boom. So basically, you want to just keep on mixing until it look like Shea Butter Baby, you feel me? Like, until your hand got copper tunnel in it, you know? And yeah, it's going to look like whipped cream, you feel me? Real nice. Giving cool whip, okay? You don't want no lumps, bumps, or disgust, okay? So yeah, once it's all luxurious and smooth like Butter Baby, that's when you're going to put it in your hair, okay? period and oh make sure you use the gloves when you're putting it in your hair because baby that thing it gets messy okay it gets messy so i'm just gonna apply it to my hair and i'll be back and show y'all what i mean by only relaxing what i'm touching up okay all right bye this is what i mean by not relaxing all your hair don't touch the relaxer i do it anyway but yeah <laughs> this is what i mean by don't relax all of your hair i'm literally just doing the new growth and the kitchen in the back is relaxed as well everything else is already relaxed so you don't want to over process it and put more relaxer on top so this is what i do some people take their uh, deep conditioner and rake it through the rest of the hair so that it doesn't um get relaxer on the rest of the hair but again this is just what i do I'm not a cosmetologist but i've never had any negative 
issues doing it this way so i already know y'all about to be like natural hair and relaxer warriors in the comment section you might as well save it you're wasting your time because i'm not going to listen regardless so yeah <laughs> this is what i've been doing my hair is growing fine so yeah um so basically i just let it sit on here until um like about 10 minutes and then i go ahead and rinse it off it's a normal so it it might take a little longer but the supers if i use the super i only would have to leave it on there for like five minutes so yeah guys i will check back in after i rinse my hair out and then y'all hear my loud ass uh what is that called ac <laughs> so yeah once i rinse it out i will come back and check in on y'all and i'll give y'all like a length check and all of that good stuff Okay, I feel like y'all would be interested in seeing this. This is how much hair came out um, from me relaxing. So this, all this was in my hairbrush. And yeah. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to Jocelyn's Cabaret. Do it like it's my B-Day, baby. Do it like it's my B-Day. <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. So this scarf on my head, it, well, it's a hair towel. It's a microfiber hair towel. It's from my friend Sahara's brand, Mammy Essentials, and I will have it linked down below. This thing gets my hair super duper uber dry. Okay, period. And yeah, so I am, I got my hair growth oil, which is from Diamond Glow, Watch It Glow and Grow, which is Diamond's brand. You already know about that. Now, the only thing I have to do is blow dry my hair. So yeah, y'all, this is pretty much how my hair is looking now. It's back to its original state. As you can see, my edges, they are smooth, baby. They are smooth, okay? And I'll show you the back of my hair. Smooth, okay? But yeah, my hair holds a lot of texture. So that's why it's not like flat on my head. I'm not going to straighten it because I don't want to put too much heat on it. I'm really just um wanted to make sure it was blow dry straight because i'm gonna do like a drawstring ponytail and like lay my edges and stuff so i wanted to make sure all my new growth was tame because baby it wouldn't have worked with that um ponytail that i'm about to attach to it so yeah guys if you are interested in how i am keeping up with my relaxer maintaining it at home self relaxing any of that here it is and that's pretty much it it's way easier for me to maintain than my natural hair was y'all so yeah and this is how y'all remember i cut bangs in my hair the last video well this is the growth of my bangs it's to my lip now uh maybe mm, my chin <laughs> but yeah so it's pretty much what's going on my regular hair as you can see we are collarbone length it's my collarbone yeah we are collarbone length in the hair so we are making progress because before we had like a little mini bobbiana going on we was at the neck but now we're at the collarbone okay okay so yeah y'all remember to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video bye